Welcome back to Minecraft Blightfall Let's Play. I am Shade of Dead, and this is episode 41. Uh, today we're we're gonna do just uh, a few things, and, and I wanted to ask you all a very important question. But first, let's just kind of get some of this uh, stuff out of the way. Now, somebody was saying, you know, hey, I hope you go back here, you scan this bad boy, you find out what's in it. There's not much in it. You know, we got eight Victus, we got five air. That's it. And also, and they're right. I should pick up this Entrepinium. I forgot to get it when I was here last. However, I do know I have uh, a, a, about a grand total of no uh, mana. So, uh, or mana, gunpowder. So, not going to be something I'm going to easily be able to do. It's weird having. Uh, Minecraft monsters and I did go ahead and make the Terra Blade. Um, this is why it's cool. <laughs> Shoots laser beams. I love it. Come here, buddy. And I'll also show you oh gosh. The Sojourner's Sash kinda makes it hard to go upstairs like this. <laughs> you, you tend to overshoot a little. Um, and I'll show you a little something I found out about it. There's a spider coming. It's a real interesting thing. I'm not really sure if it pays off in the long run. But, alright, uh, we'll use this guy for an example. We see how much mana is in it. Not, not a tremendous amount. This thing isn't going to add any because it's met night time. So this is all going to be from this. And this shoots these beams, and they look awful familiar. They look a lot like mana spreader beams, don't they? And so, I just wondered, I was curious, would these actually generate mana? And the answer is, they do. <laughs> it does. It makes mana. When I shoot this at a mana pool, it actually will charge mana into that pool. It'll increase it at a ridiculous kind of rate, actually, for the fact that I'm just standing here clicking a button. Um, let's see if we can see the change now. All right, just pay close attention. Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. All uh, right, guys, I, I'm being honest with you. Just a little while ago, <laughs> right after I did episode 40, I was I made this sword. I was messing around with it. And it was working. I was charging that mana pool with this, with this sword. <laughs> um, I don't know. Maybe I just didn't shoot it enough. Like I said, those mana pools hold a lot. You know what? All right. Comprehensive test. Where is my pickaxe? There it is. Okay. We're gonna find out for sure. We're gonna make one of these little ones. Oh my god. There. Five. Oh, five. There we go. We're gonna throw these in here, make ourselves a real quick diluted mana pool, which holds next to nothing. We're just gonna to toss it down right here. And we're gonna try this again. Alright, let's back up. If there's any mana in this thing, it works. See, I told you it works. It works. See, I put that in there. I did that. I did that with this sword. Now, it does use mana out of my ring when I swing it, and I think that's just because of the durability. I haven't tried it without the ring, actually. But it generates mana. <laughs> it makes mana. It's, it's, uh, I don't know. I guess if you're hardcore and want to get the mana that way, this is a way that you could do it. Now, you want to stand back a bit, otherwise you actually are going to swing and hit with the sword itself and not, and not just with your little laser beams. Um, and I, I've heard some concern, uh, for the livelihood of my great wood, or, yeah, my great wood tree forests. Here's the deal, guys. It, they don't eat all the leaves, alright? It does become a pain where I have to take the rotted lands and nerd pole up and chop down some of these, chop down all this. This one's going to be a real nightmare. Ugh. I, get, I grew a big one there. But, uh. It doesn't eat all the leaves. And so when I chop it down, those leaves do fall. And 
the saplings are created. There's 31 saplings right there. There's eight in that. And then if we look over here, uh, I still got 31 more. I, I'm not really worried about it. I'm not going to run out of great woods. And I'm not going to take it to a point where I'm like, I'll plant my last one and let the munch do eat it all. I'm not going to do that, guys. So, no, don't be concerned with my great woods. Uh, we'll have plenty of great woods for plenty of uh, time here in the future. And like I said, if it becomes an issue, I can just plant a set you know one set and and take these munch dews pick these munch dews up let them grow chop them all down get all the saplings again and start over it, it's not a a huge deal so um we've been generating mana as you can see uh, i've i've been taking the time to try to generate mana um i probably ought to let's go see what i got for diamonds and such uh, that's the big question. I got three diamonds. Well, and an ender pearl. Now, you might be going, where'd all the ender pearls go? I only saw five there. Well, uh, I'm going to talk about that too here in a second. Uh, you. Give me that. Actually, I'll use this one I created. My free mana from my sword. Oh, there's not enough in there. <laughs> Takes a lot more. Uh, those diluted mana pools hold next to nothing. Alright, so we got that, and I need a piece of mana steel. I got that. Okay. We're gonna make one of these. Let's see. I need this, this, and this. No. No. Damn it. <laughs> there. Okay. Uh, see, that's the big thing. You got to throw those down. And you got to get away from them before they, <laughs> before it, uh, before you pick them up again. Because any mana that's spent by this thing shooting across here is mana lost, my friend. I'll tell you that right now. It's a real nightmare. Now, one thing you could do, I suppose, is get them on there and then put your spark down. But you know, see, look, boop, half of it gone. Uh, it takes forever to get Man of Steel. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with this Entropenium. Uh, that's my... I got two pieces again. I don't know what I'm going to do with this thing. I'm going to throw it down right here for right now. If we come up with some gunpowder, uh, I'll make some TNT and show you guys. But right now, I, I literally have one piece of gunpowder. I can't make a uh, piece of TNT. I'm going to try... I've been trying... I'm going to try to make a mob farm for one thing to level up my my weapons and for another thing just because I'm gonna need the experience and everything and, and I moved my uh, enchanting table and made some new bookcases finally figured out what the deal was there's more than one kind of book and one kind just did not work for uh, whatever reason the crafting table it was a like a weird variant that I got somewhere I don't know how must have been some of those weird bookcases that we broke. I tried to build this. Tried to make this into a mob farm. Uh, great wood evidently lets light through. It, it doesn't work for... A, it's crap. It doesn't work at all. So, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's just where I have it. There may be some other factors I don't understand, but that didn't work. I'll have to chop that down. Uh, you might have saw it in a couple episodes. It's been there a little while. I've been trying to mess with it and get it working. Um, but I want to look at some of these quests that we have, and I wanted to ask you guys, you know, what do we want to do in this? Do we want to try to do every single quest in this? Do we want to go for just figuring out a path of our own through this and reach, you know, the the conclusion or at least a, a climax of this, uh, you know, and whether that be we've created the dawn machine and and we have a flying ship and we've kind of went everywhere and now it's just the slow 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 grind of slowly cleaning up all of the taint and you know all the uh, taint in the world now doing that's going to be a nightmare i can tell you that right now um but i don't know i don't know if 
the Dawn machine actually has a radius of 128 squares. And if you pump it up, you've got to add uh, essence to it, essentia to it. But if it's got a, a cleanliness area of 128 squares, and I can, I can do that, you know, at 128 squares, uh, that's that's quite a bit. Okay, so this is, so it'd be like four of these. It'd be about like this big. Depending on how long it takes to do, and basically what I think you would have to do is you're gonna have to get all get a massive stockpile of all the essentia you're gonna need in order to do it and you're gonna have to have it all hooked up in some manner or fashion or form I'm gonna have to figure it out I'm gonna have to figure out what all we need to do or how I'm gonna do that you know I'm willing to take suggestions if you guys have ideas on you know hey do it this way or hey do that I know I'm gonna need a flying ship at some point I know uh, I know that's gonna be a pain in the neck sometimes that Archimedes stuff doesn't work very good at least it didn't last time I used it and I will admit it has been quite some time since I've used uh, the Archimedes ships but they were kind of a pain in the neck when I did it before so well, that's kinda cool could never see that before. Uh, pardon me. Ah, sorry. And yes, I still have this cold. I, I'm kicking it though. It's starting to go away. Uh, let me grab a little drink here. It's starting to go away. But guys, seriously, uh, give me some comments. Let me know. Do you guys want want us to try to go through? every single one of these uh, quests do everything um, you know I can do a lot of this stuff I just haven't been doing because uh, I didn't know if it would lead to anything and you know like we want a Promethean pickaxe well I've got a little bit of just about everything you know I've got Vroxries that's that poison stuff I couldn't think of the other day we got shadow steel we got shadow iron we got just a little bit of everything. I even got some. I got five pieces of astral silver if I want to melt that down. And I've got the reason why all my ender pearls are down here is I was thinking about making some enderium, and I can make uh, quite a bit, I think, um, with my uh, with melting down my ender pearls. I've got the ten. I think it's ten. Uh, the silver, the platinum, and the. Uh, whatever it is that you those three other metals that you put with it and in basically uh, ender essence which you can get by melting ender pearls you know I've got a supply of ender pearls you know they keep coming so but uh, you know let me know guys what what do you guys think what do you think I should do what where do you think I should go how far should we go in this you know I I plan to play it at least to the point of the what I call the logical conclusion of okay at this point it's just it's just a matter of time before the game is quote unquote won the, the world is completely cleansed and the game is over um, if you guys want to see the actual me actually clean the entire world I can do that too I can do that we can keep working on this and keep doing it uh, as we get closer to the end though they're gonna be shorter and shorter episodes or further and further apart and we may start doing something else as well because it's just gonna be a matter of me going to you know I guess flying this Archimedes ship out here and cleaning up a square 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 and, and just constantly doing that because I mean this is a pretty big square it is. Now that that's not a, a small square to do right there. But still <laughs> that's a lot of squares through here to clean up everything. Turn all the ocean back to blue. Uh clean up all the blight everywhere. Uh the entire oceans or anything else. So you guys let me know what you want, what you think we should do. Um if we are gonna take it that far, like I said, there's just gonna be updates of, you know, 
I cleaned this area, I cleaned that area, what have you. I know there's still some stuff to find here. And I'm... Alright, I'm going to be honest with you guys, you know, I don't want to necessarily... I don't know if any of you guys are thinking of playing this, but I don't necessarily want to spoil everything for you. I mean, we're going to spoil a lot of the major stuff. And we're going to spoil some of the secret stuff, because we found some of it. But it looks like even the secret stuff that we found was kind of going to be found anyway. You know, the, the waterfall cave. Well, that's one of the quests that you get for the Botania flowers. It tells you to go there to find some. And you can. I mean, so, it's so far... I haven't seen anything that's been too, you know, super secret, uh, except maybe that one great wood tree, but you're going to kind of see it. Like I said, I noticed it right off on the map, but if there are any secrets out there, I don't know, do you guys want them all spoiled? Uh, do you want everything spoiled? I mean, I'm not wanting to not play this, I mean, I will play this all the way through, That that's the point, that's the reason why I'm doing it, but it just, just give me a conversation. We'll start one down in the comments. We'll talk about it a little bit about what you guys think we should do and where sh we should go. Now, we got into the blood magic stuff, and what I want to do is, I think, I know the dawn machine requires power, and I think one of the things we need to kind of look into is, um getting like some of the stuff this ME network set up. Now Skystone uh, I know where to find some of that right now and uh, we can go do that and I think we should um, I think that's going to make things a lot easier whether I know that there's a way you can store uh, Essentia in an ME network and if I can do that and connect it all up to the ship and everything else then I think Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. <laughs> then that's not a problem, but that's something we need to do. Uh, where is it even? Eh, da, da, da. Oh, this isn't the one either. What am I doing? That stupid thing. Uh, where are we? Lost, guys. We've, we've gone too many... There, Obsidian Tower. That's it. Alright, so... I know there's guys down here. We'll go get some and turn it in or show it to these guys or whatever. Still haven't cleaned this place up. Blood everywhere. You know, we got quite a bit for killing that king slime and that's definitely the way we're going to come up with our sacrifices is I'm just going to get a bunch of spawn eggs and hope I don't spawn something that just kills me because that would be bad. I had to fix this. Okay, so the that isn't quite powerful enough to get you over that block. See how I'm kind of floating right there? If you look at the thumbnail, you'll see me floating there. Uh, excuse me again. Gosh dang it. Um, so if you uh, look at the thumbnail even, you can see I'm, I'm just kind of floating here. I, it doesn't quite put you all the way up. I don't know how I got up there the first time. I mean, it's just enough. If you hit it just right, I think you will get just high enough that you can move over. But if you don't move over immediately, you end up floating like that. So I kind of fixed it. Um, so it isn't quite so much of a pain in the neck. But there's a couple things here. We should go to them. Oh, man. Brought all this junk with me. Wow, these... <laughs> See, this is a perfect place I could put one of those uh, oh man one of those trees no trees one of those flowers that eats flux they could just they could just devour this thing I don't know if the flux would uproot it or not um, but here on the map ah, there it is to the southwest we can go get ourselves some of that good good sky stone and go do that. Yeah, yeah, you guys... Oh, I'm going to kill her pig and try to kill all the other pigs. Stupid pig. Yeah, so this place blow up, blew, blowed up. So... 
Oh, whoa, whoa there, Nelly. Whoa there, Nelly. What's down there? Hmm. Crack the land asunder. Ouch. All right, let's let's get let's drop these around here. May as well get them kind of going while I am mining the sky stone here. Another stupid sheep. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! There we go. All right, let's get this stuff. How much do I need? 64. You want 64 sky stones. All right, well, I guess we'll just climb on top and start mining. Oh, uh, you probably don't want to watch me do this. All right, I'm going to go really fast. Watch this, guys. Okay, guys, we got it. <laughs> see, I told you I'd go fast. All right, uh, let's see what happens here. Oh, I can't claim that because my inventory is full of junk. Let's get rid of some of this. Oh, not that. <laughs> not my cobalt uh, pickaxe. Gosh, dang it. All right. Uh, okay, let's see what we can get rid of. Don't need the zombie head. I mean, I could use it, but I don't need it. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need those. Sorry guys, I know this is exciting whenever I do this. You know, I have to clean out my inventory, I should probably be better prepared. I thought I was actually, but <laughs> something happened, I guess. Alright, that sheep, or that creeper is just waiting for me. Just waiting for me. Alright. So we got our presses. Okay. Come on, really? Oh. Get him more sky stone. How much does he want to replace it? Oh, just 32. Why didn't you just take 32 the first time? Jerk. All right, we just got to set up a, an ME network. Okay. And see what happens. I assume I can probably get that done. And we can probably go make a stone gun, too. Uh, let's, let's go do that. Wow. Oh, wait. Can't forget my toys. Can't forget my buddies. It's kind of nice that they put off light. Uh, it makes it easy to find them at night. That's one thing I've been real concerned with, honestly, is worried that I'm going to... There's some sludge. Whoa. Oh, there. Hey, now. Oh, God, that's one of them dudes. Okay. All right, buddy. I ain't gonna mess around. Not today. Who's shooting at me now? Oh, really? With my laser sword. Wanna come at me, bro? What the heck is he fighting? That tentacle. <laughs> the bane of NPCs everywhere, I guess. Damn, man. Ugh. <laughs> He's dead. Uh, I didn't do that, but he's dead. Um, better eat one of these. Get away. God. <laughs> what do I got for food? Oh, yeah, I brought my trusty toast. I made me some toast. Alright, we're gonna heal up and we're gonna see what that fella dropped. Hope I don't die on the way. Oh, whoa, whoa, alright, alright, alright. Okay, we're gonna go back over here and heal. Oh man. Is 
Does it not work when I'm slowed and weak? I'm not shooting any lasers. There we go. It doesn't shoot them every time, but... Oh, man, we gotta get healed. Alright, I'm gonna speed this up while I heal. I realize I better try to hurry over here and find his stuff before it disappears. I might have been too late. I'm not sure exactly where he died at. Oh man. I hope I didn't lose his loot. I think I lost his loot. Well, there you go guys. News you lose. That sucks. It was anticlimactic and a pain in the butt. And just for that I should blow myself up. Oh well. Um, I'm not going to do that. Alright, we got the Sky Stone. They want us to do the ME network. Let's go make a stone gun. Let's get out of here. This place is kind of a pain to get in and out of. You gotta go all the way to the roof to leave. We should build some more arcane levitators and just make one. Oh, it'd go straight through the middle of that blood altar, wouldn't it? <laughs> wouldn't work very good. Uh, Alright. Let's get upstairs. I'm so curious about this dark one guy. If this is gonna. Is he on the up and up? I don't know. It's little. Well. Okay, buddy. Is he on the up and up? Or is he a bad guy? Is he a good guy? Is he going to come after us? Is he going to beat us up? I don't know. We got a bunch of our stuff here. Uh, we got some more stuff here to help us with. Get an ME network set up. Um, let's go ahead and... I wanted to do the stone gun here real quick. I don't think that's hard to make. I was looking at it. Let's see. Planks, cobble, cobble, a lever, and a butt. Bouton. Um, okay. <laughs> Let's see. Um, yeah. Give me, give me a couple. Oh, that's compressed. Do I just have regular cobble? There's a regular cobble. There's a regular cobble. Okay. You know what? Give me this. Usually this annoys me. This one out here, I kind of want to be... have as a... crafting station. So I can just put stuff down and leave it. Alright, so there's cobble. There's cobble. Um, it, it wants a plank. A plank, a plank, a plank. Uh, let's see if gray wood planks work. I have no idea if this will work or not. We need a button. Um, button? Is that stone? Yeah, I gotta have stone. Alright, so we got some day sight. That should work, right? Yeah, excellent. Button. Hopefully that works. That's a day sight button. I guess we'll find out. And I think I'm gonna have to uncompress some of this cobblestone. Here we go. So I can get me. Let's see, I need a stick. A stick so I can make a lever. Alright, let's see if this works. Sometimes using all these different kinds of wood. No, of course not. <laughs> of course not. Of course it won't work. It's probably the button. It's probably the wood too. Um I got any stone cooking? I guess not. Let's get in there. Uh Alright, just give me a regular oak plank. Give me one of those. Let's try this again, guys. Alright, oak plank. Now oh, I gotta make a button. Button. Oh, I said oak plank. Dang it, go in there. Stone gun, six damage, only fire stone bullets, highly inaccurate. Yeah, yeah. My name is Dead. Shade of Dead. Down 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 Alright. Alright, so we've got a stone pistola. Let's see what this guy gives us for that. 
He just wants to see if we can do it. He's going to give us some bullets. <laughs> Is that it? Oh, uh, uh, completed. Doesn't go anywhere, huh? Guess we need to do... Oh, he wants me to make some Envar armor? Uh, alright. Well, I guess here next episode, I'm going to get some of this stuff ready. We'll start working on these uh, quests. I want you guys to tell me, uh, again, what do you want to do with this? How far do we want to go? Do we want to do all the quests? Do we just want to cleanse the world? Do we want to do just to the point where we have the capability of cleansing the world and call it good? Or do you want to see it all? Because this will probably drag on for a long time if it, you want me to actually cleanse the entire world by myself. So, I don't know. Maybe it won't. I guess you guys tell me. What do you want to see? Uh, and uh, we'll... We'll see what we do in the next episode. I have a plan for what I want to do after this one. So, um, well, depending on when we get done with this one. And because I'm going to do Fallout 4. <laughs> because Fallout is my favorite thing ever. So, uh, well, it's not my favorite game. It's my maybe second favorite game. But Fallout, we'll be doing that for sure. I plan to have this done by then. But... You guys tell me what you want to do, and we'll talk about it in the comments a little bit, and we will go from there. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate you tuning in. I know maybe we didn't get a whole lot done this episode, but I felt like there were some things we needed to talk about, some things we needed to do in order to... So I kind of know what you are expecting, and we can figure out what we want to do on this, all right? So thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.